The precious, the precious advice of Luqman to his son. The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "The religion is nasiha. Nasiha means sincere advice. A wise man known as Luqman gave beautiful advice to his son on how to be successful in this world and the hereafter. His advice should be used." By any parent wanting to raise a child in the light of Islam, the advice of Luqman is mentioned in the Quran. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says, "And remember when Luqman said to his son, while advising him, 'O oh my dear son, never associate anything with Allah, for indeed associating partners with Allah.'" Is a great injustice. How to say it? Shirk is a major sin which leads a person to the hellfire for eternity. If anyone, including your parents, pressure you to do the shirk with Allah, then we are not allowed to obey them. Allah states in the Quran, and we have commanded people to honor their parents. Their mothers bore them through hardship upon hardship. And their weaning takes two years, so be grateful to me and your parents. To me, is the final return. But if they pressure you to associate with me, what you have no knowledge of, do not obey them. Rather, accompany them with kindness in this world. Luqman then tells his son to remember that Allah is constantly watching us. Allah's knowledge is perfect. Anything that happens. What will happen in this world is already known by Allah. The command says, "O oh my dear son, even if a deed were the way of mustard seed in a rock, or in the heavens or the earth, Allah will bring it forth. Surely Allah is the most subtle, all aware. O oh my dear son, even if..." O oh, my dear son, established prayer, encourage what is good and forbid what is evil, and endure patiently whatever befalls you. Indeed, that is of the matters requiring determination. Then Luqman emphasizes on having good manners with the people. He says, and do not turn your cheek away from people. Nor walk on this earth arrogantly. Surely Allah does not like whoever is arrogant, boastful. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala appreciated the advice of Luqman, and says, "Indeed, we bless Luqman with wisdom, saying, 'Be grateful to Allah, for whoever is grateful, it is only for their own good, and whoever is ungrateful.'" Then surely Allah is self-sufficient and praiseworthy.